Grand Rising on this August 8th, 2021. Could probably be one of the most esoteric times and advents in our lifetime. I was reminded about this day when the Lionsgate portal began to open up on July 28th and continue through August 12th and today the 8th is supposed to be the most uh, powerful day of manifestation. We are in the process of recovering what was lost and hidden a long time ago. To the Asiatic people, this is our time. As a matter of fact, in my belief, this is one of the reasons that we've seen so much chaos in the last not only 400 years but especially in the last two years sitting out here and this year after many years decided to grow a garden it was a will and a desire and a manifest uh, growing zucchini squash chard uh, collard, cucumber, and soon uh, carrots. But in my belief, this is one of the reasons that they had to maximize chaos through a man made uh, germ. also use a multi-dimensional form of propaganda to continue to disconnect us from the Most High, from everything around us that is natural, including the sun. And this is why they were attempting the hybrids, the European Albion hybrids who live on the dark side and who have no soul and no spirit attempted to block the greatest light in our galaxy and for those of you who have studied you know there are even larger suns than ours some say maybe 10 times or 20 times larger of course, you know we're not the only life form. Never has been. But this is a great day. And for wherever you are, you will see what I'm talking about. You hear the, the birds chirping. You hear the wind. You see the sun. And this is the greatest gift. When you look around at this greenery here, plant life. This is much more valuable than anything that you can possess. As I stated many times, it doesn't matter what type of car or vehicle you put you drive travel in or own or so-called own because you really don't own it as long as you continue to pay taxes and uh, allow the state of to hold the title oh you see a red bird over here cardinal hmm. but doesn't matter 
what type of house you live in doesn't matter how much stock you have it doesn't matter one of my uh, mentors father figures the late great Dick Gregory would always state money's not power information is power So hopefully the ones that are connected and attempt to connect with universal law and truly believe and not only believe but feel the connection you have with the elements of the earth, of the wind, of the fire of the water it's not just about knowing or believing it's about feeling feeling the connection and if you do not feel the connection you will not heal you will not evolve evolve to the next paradigm because we are in a paradigm shift and for, unfortunately some will be left behind because even in the Surah and the Quran states and Allah has put a seal over their hearts and covered their eyes and closed their ears. Some will not receive the message. Even some of the people that you are very close to, friends or relatives, would not receive the message. They will not feel what is really really transpiring on the esoteric level because they're so in tuned indoctrinated and under the spell of the television and within that television your puppets that are there to lure you deep deep within the crevices of the matrix so you can never receive this message this is why there's so much chaos this is a game this is a chess game they know the bigger the diversion the more chaos the more propaganda they uh, disseminate the weak-minded people will be derailed they'll go up the wrong road they will not connect with what is real and what our ancestors and the ancients have prophesied thousands and thousands and thousands of years ago. Many out there don't even know the history of that place called the District of Columbia and recall and honor Benjamin Banneker, who not only structured DC but lined it up the ley lines with the equator an immaculate structure setting it up as ancient Akupta which is you people call Egypt but again the day is the eighth day of August 2021 for those that received this message hope you will embrace it you will meditate you will will the divine desires of human life peace balance health because you without health you have no wealth look up as I always stated before all the famous CEOs, actors that you've seen passing on year after year have millions and billions of dollars and all the wealth that they possess could not save them.
because information is power. What you travel in, what you live in, what's in your pocket cannot save you. It's what's within your temple that can save you. We've been, the people unfortunately have been led down a path of destruction for many, many years instead of tapping into their own higher science, intuition, and feeling what is around you and knowing by instinct just like you know any other animal whether it be an animal or prey or just a scavenger animal I mean they have natural instinct and we have lost our natural instinct we have lost our natural state of mind because you have allowed a hybrid to manipulate through manip, manipulate you through the educational system through the corporate construct through civics through a de facto system they've led you into a democracy which is really the rule of the devil this is why we're catching so much hell because you fail to realize that this great nation stood on the foundation of a republic it's like most of you out there think that the United States is a country this is a continent North America we have many countries within this continent But take the time for those of you who desire to reach a new paradigm, meditate today and will peace among yourselves, goodwill toward a discerning people. We don't have much time. Dr. Botanica, peace and be well.